Hello my friend. I am Dr. Dewill. I understand, you are a very busy person, as you seem to be in a real hurry. But, to rise high in your career, I think you need to learn a quick lesson, on business etiquette. So, would you like to play a quick game with me? If you win, you will join the League of Excellent Professionals, who have good etiquette, and are poised to excel in life. If you lose, this elevator will directly take you to my dungeon, and you will be my corporate slave forever. Excellent choice. Let me now tell you the rules of the game. I shall take you through the various departments in my office. In each department, I shall introduce you to a colleague of mine, who will provide you with interesting details of business etiquette, relevant to that department. I shall keep appearing once in a while, and test your knowledge. If you score well, I shall give you access to enter the next department, and if you fail to score well, you will lose a chance. I am a very fair person, so I shall give you three chances to escape my dungeon. Remember, if you fail, you will be my slave. Once you complete successfully, I shall also show you a leaderboard, with how much you have scored, and how good are you compared to others. The progress bar will show, how much more you need to go, and the scoreboard will show you, your current score. Shall we begin? Before we start learning about greeting etiquette, let me ask you a quick question. Do you know, why we greet people? Let's take a quick check. Click on the correct reason, why you think we greet people. Some very commonly used greetings for starting a conversation are, Hi. Hello. Good morning. Nice to meet you. Glad to meet you. How are you? How do you do? You may not always get a second chance to start a conversation. So, with proper greeting etiquette, you can establish a perfect initial rapport, and strike a conversation as per the situation. Jack is new to the company, and he sees his new desk neighbor Sarah, sitting at her desk. Help Jack start a conversation with Sarah, by placing the right text in his call out. The two main forms of greeting etiquettes are, formal, and informal greetings. When we greet someone with a formal customary code, it is a formal greeting. And when we greet someone casually, or without any formal customary code, it is an informal greeting. Greetings are usually expressed verbally, or using gestures, and sometimes both together. Some common formal verbal greetings are, Glad to meet you. How are you doing? Nice to meet you. Good morning. Good afternoon or good evening, and thank you, and popular formal gestures include, a firm handshake, bow, hand kissing, namaste, a polite smile, touching the feet, and saluting. Now let's look at some of the types of handshakes. When a person is nervous, his sympathetic nervous system often becomes overactive, sometimes resulting in sweaty palms. A brush-up handshake is a quick grasp, and then a release, that feels like your hand is being shoved aside, as the person does not intend to interact with you. A politician handshake is your hand firmly grasped, as in a normal handshake, and their other hand may cover yours, or be placed on your forearm, or shoulder. In a bone crusher handshake, the person continuously squeezes your hand until you cringe, clearly designed to intimidate you. Your handshake will be positive and effective if you plant your feet in front of the other person and lean slightly forward. Lock onto the other person's eyes and share a smile while extending your hand. 
always avoid looking at the hand, as hands know how to find each other without the help of your eyes. The palm of each hand should make complete contact, while the fingers create a firm grip. Shake three to four times while eyes are engaged. Exchange pleasant small talk until the hands naturally move apart. Before shaking hands, always make sure that your hands are clean and dry. Hands are soft. You can use lotion or moisturizer if required. Your fingernails are well manicured. Fingers are free of large, obtrusive rings, and your breath is fresh and clean. Which of the following is a characteristic of a positive handshake? Match the handshake with the corresponding attribute by dragging and placing it next to the type of handshake. Hi, and Hello are the most commonly used informal greetings in business. Sometimes the word good is dropped, and only Morning, afternoon, or Evening is said instead of Good morning, good afternoon, or Good evening to make it informal. What's up is another popular informal verbal greeting among youngsters. Informal greeting gestures include doing a high five, hugging, hand waving, and casual two finger saluting. I hope you like this sample.